Alrighty, good morning everybody. We are live. We are ready to go. It is Friday. Unbelievable. Friday and we are at a long weekend. Yeah, that's right. Here in Canada, it is the unofficial end of summer. It's the Labor Day long weekend. We are here. We're not stopping. We got some cardio to do today. We got a bunch of stuff lined up here. So we're ready to go pretty much. I just got two things I got to do. And I uh, just want to move this here a little bit. Bear with me. There we go. I think that's a little bit better right there. Let's get the glasses on and triple check that scene. Yeah, I think that ought to work. Alrighty. How's everybody doing? It's Friday unbelievable it's friday and it's a long weekend the labor day long weekend here in canada yeah kind of a exciting time uh also a sad time because we know that it's the unofficial end of summer and uh yeah you know it always always hurts a little bit when we say that you know the unofficial end of summer Okay, I am going to just slightly move this back because it really does feel like I'm a little bit close. Alrighty, let's hop on. Oh, that's a little crooked. Yikes. Let's try that again. We got a little bit a little bit of uh, just minor setup going on here. There we go. I think that's a little better. Okay. Okay, I got, I got the chat up. I can pretty much see what's going on. Speaking of that, grab my tablet over here. Okay, so today is uh, going to be a steady state ride. Uh, we're not going to knock any knock anything out of the park too hard today because I've got a monstrous leg workout this afternoon that I have to do. And I don't want to uh, go too crazy this morning. Uh, so that's kind of where I'm at today. We did actually miss yesterday doing the leg workout so okay we need to put a little tension on here because that's just we are just winging it there okay okay but how's everybody doing let me know how you're doing on a friday morning we were ah, maybe a couple of minutes behind schedule i was just setting everything up Okay, so we're just getting everything set up and uh, trying to log in here. Never seems to want to work on this tablet. I don't know why. Maybe I don't have any. Oh, that probably be why I'm not connected to the Wi-Fi. Hits and bits, how you doing? I see you there. I'm just trying to get logged in here. Bear with me. Let's try this again. There we go. How you doing? 60 days till Halloween. You're still going on about that Halloween thing. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Turn that volume down. Yikes. Yikes. There we go. That's better. You're still, you're still talking about that. <laughs> That's funny. All right, let's try this again for the third time, I'm trying to get in. Halloween is a fun time of year, I don't deny. <laughs> you know, it, it really is. I, I do agree with you, it is a fun time of year. It's been a little while since I've dressed up and gone out on Halloween over the years. I, I, I won't deny that. I did go out in my 30s, and we did go to some Halloween parties back in the day. You know, uh, yeah, there's a lot of fun to be had 
I've got you a devilish guy. Oh, that's hilarious. That is kind of funny. All right, there we go. Trying to keep tabs. Oh, is it going to let me Chromecast for real? I don't know if it's going to let me. All right, well, we got it right there. We can hopefully keep tabs on it. Okay. Well, I was saying before you popped in, unless you were lurking there briefly, that uh, uh, I'm a hellhound, so I guess I have a devil. <laughs> uh, well, I, I was actually uh, just it's just before you popped in, was just talking about the up here in Canada specifically. It's the end of summer, even though. Technically, on the calendar, it actually goes to um, September 21st or something crazy like that. But, uh, yeah, this is this long weekend here in Canada. This is a big one. You know, this is the unofficial end. Summer's kind of come to the close. Because even the last couple of nights up here, it's got really cool at night. Like, we're talking the other night... It was into like the 48 degree mark, you know, 46 degree mark, which here in August, yeah, that's that's cold, <laughs> especially at night and in the mornings. Like it was single, like it was cold. Like up here, we're in the metric system, right? So it was like eight degrees, which would be like 46. Like that's cold. So it's kind of sad to see on the one hand, but it is what it is. Like we're not changing anything, right? So... Anyways, other than that, how you doing there, Hits? Hope you're well. We're uh, just doing a steady state ride today. Nothing out of the ordinary. Or nothing crazy. I got a big monster's leg workout later today. So just trying to, trying to conserve a little bit of my energy for later on. I did miss it yesterday, but we're coming back this afternoon with a big monster leg workout. So just doing a steady state ride today. Gonna get the ab circuit in. So basically, uh, moving forward, we've got uh, we got some stuff coming up, some big changes coming next week. Looking forward to that. Uh, we've got. Uh, Gonna have some new foods coming in. Gonna hit the gonna hit the uh, cookbook, and uh, gonna get some new stuff going on. <laughs> and uh, we got the new program, our new uh, our next six weight a uh, six week weight loss or cut, whatever you want to call it, starting on Monday. So got a bunch of stuff happening. So looking forward to next week and the weeks moving forward after that should be. A lot of fun and uh, yeah we're uh, we're gonna be on the right track hitting it out of the park <laughs> there you go there you go Oh, did you did you read the I I can't see that because I don't uh, I've, I'm I've uh, I got it I don't have that like that super chat going here hold on I can uh, I didn't know you uh, redeem that I can't see that here hold on and I'll see that here I'll switch over to this I was on another one there Oh, hits and bits. His first time here, he's lying. He's like a repeat offender over here. <laughs> there he is. First time here. 
Yeah, I got a bunch of them in there now, and they all and they all do work. At least the last time I checked, they were. Woohoo! Yeah, I see it flying now. Yeah. Well, we, uh, yeah, there's a bunch of them in there now, so hopefully, uh, hopefully they're all working. Psycho gave me a hand with them one Sunday night. Yeah, I saw that. I know. you Now you're like a repeat offender. <laughs> So did you ever officially tell us, I think you did, but I don't recall, what were you planning on dressing up on as, uh, for Halloween? What are you dressing up as? Wasn't it like some scary devil or something? Or I think you did say it yesterday or the day before you were what you were planning on dressing up as right 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 okay I I have to look that up I have to admit I don't officially know what that or who that is or anything like that but okay I do recall now that I read that you did say that I have to admit, like, I don't remember, I see, I think we have pictures of, like, what we dressed up as kids, um, back in the day. I know I went out as Ace Freely from Kiss one year, and I think I went as, uh, Gene Simmons another year. Yeah, that's kind of, did kind of to, uh, deter people from doing it, because then I gotta stop and go do it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I put that in there as like a last mi last minute thing, and I was kind of like, how much should I put it at? But yeah, and that's to deter from doing it too often, because I don't want to have to stop and get off the bike or stop my workout to go get that song. <laughs> yeah, I haven't set up like what. What's his name there? I haven't got it all set. Like, switching over to OBS was, a, like, a real chore for me. Because I just don't know OBS. And everybody's like, oh, it's the same as Prism. Well, actually, no. In my opinion, it's not even close. Prism was so simple to use. But this is not, to me, it's not even night. It's night and day difference. So, I found it very complicated. <laughs> Absolutely, 100%. Hang out, keep me laughing. There you go. <laughs> so, I mean, I know, you know, at the end of the day, it's probably something to do with being old school. And, uh, but I found Prism so easy to use and so user friendly to figure out without having to sit down and watch, like, you know, video after video after video on how to do this, that, and the other. But, yeah, OBS, yeah, significantly different and significantly more complicated to figure out, at least in my opinion. I know there'll be plenty of people think that I'm nuts, but I don't really care. I'm just telling you how I found it. I mean, it is a great software, don't get me wrong. I don't know. I mean, there's certainly great things about each platform that are really, really cool and really good, but I just found OBS to be a little bit more difficult. So what do you got planned 
today moving forward on Friday and into into the weekend. Like I know you guys don't celebrate down there Labor Day weekend. Like up here it Monday, it's a stat holiday. Coast to coast, everything's closed. It's a big deal up here for us. There's parades in every single major city across this country for Labor Day, like Labor Day Union parades. It's a big deal. So down there, not a big deal at all. Monday, everything's wide open. I even talked to Psycho. He says, no, no, I'm working Monday. Yeah, exactly. What's Labor Day? In Canada, when you spell labor, by the way, it's L-A-B-O-U-R. We have a U in there. It's a stat holiday, coast to coast, nationwide, and uh, it's to celebrate, you know, labor, workers, right? And uh, there's parades in every city across the country, coast to coast. It's a big deal up here. And on top of all of that, it's a, it's a stat holiday. It's, it's a major holiday. So, yeah, I was... I only learned like in the last 20 odd years that you guys don't even celebrate it down there. It's not even a ho it's not even a holiday, let alone celebrate. So, yeah, it's a, it's a it's a big deal up here. What the heck does that mean? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that means. What you just wrote? Okay. 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 I think. <laughs> Re drum. Okay, 15 minutes in already, halfway there, and we will be at our 30 minutes in no time. Hits, you game? Okay. Okay, so we're more than halfway through this morning cardio. And we're going to do our ab circuit. 
We're going to get some stretching in. Then from there, we're going to, this afternoon, knock out of the park our leg workout. We've got a big leg workout coming up this afternoon. So I'm looking forward to that big time. And then uh, from there, Saturday, we'll be back for morning cardio. Uh, probably do battle ropes more than likely. Uh, and then we'll, uh, we'll do some biceps and triceps after the, well, we'll do abs and then we'll do biceps and triceps again. And then we'll uh, get our stretching in. So we've got a big, uh, we've got a big workout plan. Now Sunday will be off. Won't be on at all. And then uh, Monday, we'll be back and we'll unveil our all new six week cut program. Looking forward to that. And uh, try and get some information as well posted up on uh, on Discord. Maybe we'll uh, put something in the, create something for that in Discord. Keep, keep tabs on that there a little bit. So yeah, so that's what's going on. Uh, looking forward to that big time. So yeah, lot, lots of good stuff coming up. Really looking forward to the next phase. And uh, yeah, pretty, pretty, uh, pretty excited actually. Quite, quite excited, quite uh, stoked and pumped for this. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a good one. We can switch back. There we are. Alrighty, let's see if we can get in here on this and do anything. I don't know if I can or not. No, probably not. Okay. So that's what's uh, that's what's going on. So we got a lot of exciting things happening. Uh, September, we're we're still going to continue with the outdoor workouts for as long as we can, as long as that weather holds out. So I have to admit, there's uh, exciting uh, times working outside. You know, I do I do enjoy that. I I was thinking seriously about doing legs outside today. I don't know. We'll see. It, it's on it is something I've been mulling over I've done one leg workout outside um, so we will see I, I have to admit though I do enjoy the home you know home workouts here but I'll, I'll, I'll see I'll see if I'll do it outside today so yeah we'll, we'll, we'll give it some thought Appreciate you lurking in the chat, hanging out. It's awesome. Appreciate it. Thank you. We're uh, we're here getting that cardio and just a steady state ride. We're not doing any major hit today. Uh, I will do hit tomorrow for sure in the form of battle ropes. Uh, and then uh, next week, uh, I'll be a little bit more um, regimented on the cardio. Uh, when it comes to what day I'm going to do what on that. I, I, normally, I just kind of wing it. I come down, just knock off cardio. I don't really give it a lot of thought. I don't overthink it, quite frankly. I don't really like overthinking it because I just think that overcomplicates it. Uh, even when it comes to my afternoon workouts, I normally, for the most part, already know what I'm going to do. So it's not like i got to sit there and figure it all out. I kind of already know. So, I know everybody's different. That's that's perfectly fine. It's totally, that's a, a lot of people like to have things really mapped out. And for the most part, I just, you know, I come down to the basement or whether it's outside, and I just kind of know what I'm going to do. You know, whether it be chest, or, chest and triceps, I already know what I'm going to do. Uh, I don't deviate too far out of the exercises that work for me. And 
that's the kind of person that I am. If I know that's going to do something for me, and it's going to work for me, and I like it, uh, then I just do it. Um, I don't, I don't stray too far from that. Like, I don't get into like one-legged squats. I see people do these things. I'm like, yeah, no, I'm, that's, I'm not doing that at my age. <laughs> it's just not going to happen. So I kind of stay within the the boundaries that I like. Um, you know, so I, I, I know for me what works for me and what doesn't work for me. So I, I don't, I don't stray too far from that. Squats, for instance, I don't put the barbell on my neck anymore and do squats. I just don't do that. Number one, it really bothers my shoulder. And when it bugs my shoulders, I just, I don't do it. So that's where we came up with the whole idea of the landmine hack squat you know or you can just call it a landmine squat that that's where all that came from and then I switched and I went to the front squat I mean I'd done front squats in you know in the last 30 years but um, but I hadn't done them in a while and I switched and that's where the sissy squat came from you know so I just don't do traditional squats anymore it doesn't work for me it hurts my shoulder I do have shoulder issues so you know, I, I just do what works for me. So, um, and I've really actually fallen in love with this landmine squat. Like, I can't even begin to tell you what a difference it is. It's a huge, huge difference maker. And I, I quite frankly, I love it. It works for me. So if it works for me, I'm gonna do it. Um, the standing military press with the landmine, that's just another, thing that just kind of happened accidentally because my my ceiling is so low down here in, in the house I can't do a standing military press I just can't do it I'll you know I blow the ceiling out <laughs> you know the ceilings like right there so I can't do it but then one day you know we're standing here after I built the um, the stand boom it's like hey I can do that I got the attachment that's where it came from it just happened very innocently and it was like that's perfect so I just do things that work for me and work in the confines of the gym that I have to work within and these are all the little things that just kind of came out of nowhere and it's like hey that works hey that works oh that works you know so that's how it all happens so, and sometimes it's that's the best way it just happens innocently and you know um, deadlifts I, I I hadn't done deadlifts in years. That's another one that just kind of came back out of nowhere. Back about, I don't know how many years ago it was now, 2010, 13 years ago, I did deadlift. And I, I had been doing them and my knee popped. Took, took months to heal. I didn't do deadlifts again for years. I only just started doing them now again in the last like three months. I hadn't really done a lot of deadlifts, so I just started doing them again. And uh, I mean, I'm not pushing any kind of serious or lifting any kind of serious weight. You know, I mean, I'm getting stronger. There's no doubt about it. And I am doing them a lot more frequently. And I even did some rack pulls recently. I hadn't, I never done a rack pull before. And uh, I have to actually. That's one thing I do want to incorporate a little bit more. So. Yeah, so there's just little things, and you know, you watch other streamers, and you see what they're doing. You go, oh, yeah, that's a good idea, you know. And so that that's how it kind of happens. So, um, so the the one thing I always, you know, try and encourage or just try for myself, just keep an open mind when you're watching someone else do something. Hey, would that work for me? Or oh, I forgot all about that. Or and so there's all those. It's, it's never you're never too old to learn. And you should never be too close-minded that you're not willing to learn. Learning is, is a wonderful, wonderful thing. So, yeah, so that's kind of where we're at today. And uh, being, being someone, at, you know, I'm 55 now, so I'm not like 25. But being 55 and, uh, you know, a little bit older, hopefully a little bit wiser, I try and work out you know, with what I can do and uh, getting down here and, 
hitting cardio. Like I'll be honest, riding the bike like a year ago was like, oh my goodness, it was, it was painful. <laughs> Drove me nuts. I just didn't have the patience for it. But the minute I started streaming, and you know, give me a chance to chat with people and have some fun, all of a sudden it was kind of like a whole different thing. And now it's like. I don't actually mind it. I'm not going to sit here and lie and say that I enjoy it, <laughs> but I've tried to bring a little bit of fun and laughter and humor to it and, and try and bring a little bit of a, a smile to it. And it, it does become significantly different. So, uh, so yeah, you just, you got to do with what you got to, you got to do. And, you know, I've had this stationary bike now for, I think I've had this at least four or five years now, I think. Hardly ever rode the thing. <laughs> like, literally hardly ever rode. I think I got it in 2019. I know I got it before the pandemic. I know that for a fact. <laughs> and, uh, you know, but it's just, again, it becomes one of those things. It's like, you know, okay. Do I really want to do that? And for a long time, it was, I mean, it was the best dust collector I'd ever owned. <laughs> but we're on it every, almost every day now. The battle ropes is something that I learned from somebody else. So I bought a set and I have them and I love them. I can't do them every day though. So, and they're really noisy. So, <laughs> you know, I do enjoy them though. I do really enjoy them, but I have to, I can only do them a few days a week, so. Uh, on that note, uh, I do own another stationary bike that's off to the side there. I think they call it a recumbent bike. The wheels, you know, you're down lower and the wheels way out in front of you. I had that one first. I've had that one for years. And normally my wife will ride that one and then I ride this one, but we haven't convinced her to come on down and get on cam yet, so. I don't know, maybe one day. Okay, so we are closing in on getting into our 30th minute. I think that says 29 minutes and 35 seconds. We are almost at our 30 minute mark already. That's awesome. Okay. We're closing in on 30 minutes, just like that, chatting away, getting it done. Okay, there is our 30 minutes. Again, we weren't knocking anything out of the park. This was just a easy, you know, steady state ride. Okay, let's mark this all down. We've got our glasses here I can actually see and hard to believe it is September 1st my goodness okay okay 30 minutes 15 seconds eight point three one And calories, 124.7. Okay, so let's uh, move the drink out of the way. Okay, we're gonna put the bike away. Okay, one moment. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna move over to our ab circuit. So, We've got leg raises, 
frog crunches, obliques, bicycles, uh, weighted ab crunches, and we're going to wrap it up with Russian twists. So that's what's on the agenda. Okay, I need my glasses for a second. If you see that link there in the chat, make sure you give me a follow, give me a subscribe on my YouTube channel. We're trying to grow it, and uh, certainly would appreciate the uh, sub there for sure. We're just shy of two hundred currently, so. That'd be awesome if you'd throw me a sub there. Okay. All right, so let's get started. I'm pretty much ready to go. Uh, drink is there. Okay, so I think we're good back here. Actually, I'm gonna just slightly fix that. All right, let's try that there. I think that's a little bit better. Yeah, okay. All right, let's get her done. Let's start with the abs. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go. All right, leg raises. Okay, frog crunches. Okay, bicycles. crunches Okay, Russian this. Okay. All right, circuit number one done. Round one completed. You know, it's really amazing I, that circuit the toughest circuit I think I've picked and put together it's a hard one I, I do feel that one okay we'll take a minute we'll uh, we'll get uh, catch our breath and then we'll go again and we're gonna do four rounds today Yeah, feeling that one, let me tell you, feeling that one big time. Okay. Uh, let's check the bit rate real quick. Make sure everything is good with the stream. Oh yeah, yeah, it's good, it's in good shape, no problem. Okay, all right, I think uh, we'll go here in a moment. Appreciate you hanging out, lurking. You wanna stop in, say hi, don't be shy. 
pop right on in, chat away, got the chat up, I can see you, and uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll chat with you and see how things are going. It's Friday, right before a long weekend, here in Canada, apparently not in the States. We got uh, the big Labor Day weekend here, so lots and lots of things going on, so Alrighty, let's do it. Let's get down. Let's knock off another ab circuit. Okay, here we go. Leg raises. Okay, frog crunches. Okay, bicycles. Okay, whew, felt that one. Okay, weighted ab crunches. Okay, now we're going to move over to Russian twists. Okay, all right, break time, that was round number two, done. Okay. Okay, round number two completed. We're getting her done. We're getting her done. It's a tough one. I can't deny it. It's a tough one, but we're doing it. We're getting it done. Okay. All right, we're going to catch our breath. And then we are going to go again. All right, let's just take a moment. 6 a.m. in the morning. If I can uh, fix this, okay. Okay, we're going again. Whew. Can really feel that one in the abs today already. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get her done. Okay. Okay, leg raises.
dog crunches. Okay. Bicycles. Okay, weighted ab crunches. Okay, for Russian twist. Okay, here we go. Russian twist. Okay. We got her done. Another round finished. Okay, all right, that is three rounds down of our ab circuit. We have one more to go, and then we're gonna move on to stretching. Whew, man, feeling that one today. Yeah, that's a good one, real good one. I did hear some beeps and stuff, so I don't know what's what that was all about, but that's okay. Okay. Next week, the, the new cut begins, targeting seven pounds between Labor Day Monday and Thanksgiving Monday in October. So looking forward to that. Uh, so we're gonna bring some uh, some new foods into the pro. When I say new foods, I, I gotta be careful how I word this. Uh, basically, I'm just getting some new ideas for some recipes. I guess it is. So uh, gonna bring some new stuff in. So we're looking forward to that. Um, Cardio is gonna stay the same in the mornings. I might be a little bit more diligent or regimented when it comes to. You know, Monday do this, but I, I am a really spontaneous person, so I don't really like having to be regimented that this day I'm doing this and then that day I'm doing that. And then I, I do like to sometimes wing it. I, I really do. Some days you come down, you're like, ah, I don't want to do the rolling machine. You know, maybe your back's bugging you. You know, I do deal with a lot of carpal tunnel and forearm problems. So, like today, I was going to do battle ropes, but they were really bugging me. I'm like, nah, we'll just do a steady state ride. So, I work better being spontaneous, I, I, I have to admit. So, with the afternoon workouts, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to review. I, I'm probably not going to make a whole lot of changes, but I do want to bring a couple of things back into the fold. Uh, I do want to be a little bit more diligent in getting the pullovers in on back day. Um, so, there's a few little things that I'm going to do, uh, just going to incorporate. But I, again, I don't like to sit down and map out my workout and I'm going to do this and I'm going to, again, I'm very spontaneous and I like to keep it that way. I don't like to have things like fully mapped out and, you know, like, well, I got to do this and I got, like yesterday I didn't do legs. I really wanted to, just it didn't fit my schedule yesterday. I don't beat myself up about it. I come back today, I'll knock it off this afternoon. It's just the way it is, um, you know. So, but anyways, that, that's, uh, but we've we got a lot of things coming for the fall and, uh, I can't let everything out of the bag yet, but it's, there's going to be some exciting stuff coming. So 
Alrighty, let's uh, let's get the last set in because I do want to get a great stretch in today. So here we go. Let's knock off the last round number four of our ab circuit. Starting off with leg raises. Here we go. Ten leg raises. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, frog crunches. Ten. Bicycles. Okay. Whew. All right. Weighted ab crunches. Here we go. Okay. Russian twists. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, <sighs> Okay. That was round number four. Okay. Awesome. Whew. Okay, all right, we're gonna move on to stretching. 610, nice and early, getting it done. Whew. Okay, we are three subscribers away from reaching our goal of 200. That is awesome. We are right there. We got to reach it today. Okay. Okay. Very, very close to our goal of 200 subs on YouTube. That's going to be awesome. Looking forward to that. Should hit it today. Okay. One moment and we're going to start some stretching. Looking forward to it already. Looking forward to it already. Okay. Whew. All right, let's get some stretching in and uh, let's get started. We get back here far enough so you can see. All right, okay, let's go. Stretching is something that most people just don't do enough of. Very, very important. Back a few months ago, I'll tell you a little story.
fact a few months ago, I was having plantar fasciitis in my left foot. And I'm like, where? Is, well, it's probably back. Might have actually been uh, February, March. Actually, it was a little bit before that. Yeah, it was probably more in March. And I'm like, what's that for? Like, what the heck is that? And, uh, you know, of course, we now Dr. Google everything, right? And so I was not 100% sure what it was in the very beginning, you know, and uh, it got to the point where it's getting like painful just to walk and uh, started stretching like what I'm doing right here within literally two days, pain was gone. That's because I wasn't stretching every day like I do now. Like now I'm very, very diligent in ensuring that I'm down here literally every single morning. I mean, there's the odd day I can't get down here for, you know, usually work related issues, but I make sure I stretch. Stretching is certainly one of the more underrated, forgotten things that just we just don't do, and it is so important that we do it. Let's go to the other side. That side is definitely tighter than the other side. There is no doubt about that. Whew. Okay. Keeping tabs on the chat, even though we're down here on the floor, I'm still doing my best to watch. Yeah, so my the plantar fasciitis issue came out of nowhere and all of a sudden I had this pain down in my ankle and my Achilles and it was to a point where it was getting tough to walk. And uh, like I say, you know, we started Googling it up like, what the heck is that? And yeah, started stretching and doing all these stretches that I'm doing right now. It's gone two days, done, gone. Even though I stretch every single day, especially, you know, been very diligent now the last number of weeks in a row, I still, you know, get down here in the morning and the hams are tight. Like it is really amazing.
I can feel it now starting to limber up. We're starting to get there. I see something there. I see something there. What's going on? Oh, ho, ho. Snow, what's going on? Woohoo! Appreciate you coming in. How you doing this morning? I was in there earlier checking out. I know you were hitting it up hard. We're doing some uh, major uh, stretching today. That's what I'm uh, just finishing up. We did a bike ride, uh, did my ab circuit. Uh, now we're doing. Uh, now we're getting in some much, much needed uh, stretching. So, no, I appreciate you coming over and hosting, bringing over your community. Hey, if you don't know who I am, I'm Liberty Street Rock and uh, fitness streamer here, lead singer, bass player of my band, Liberty Street Rock. So, hey, if you're not following, absolutely make sure you smash that button, throw us a follow, appreciate it. And uh, every new follow gets 10 push-ups. So, yeah. Appreciate you coming in. How was your workout, by the way? I'm sure you were uh, knocking it out of the park there for sure. Yeah, awesome, awesome. Oh, that's fantastic. That's great. Yeah, I'm getting in a, definitely getting in a much needed uh, stretch today. Uh, I mean, I stretch every day, but some days it just doesn't quite go as well as other days. So you kind of feel that. And so, yeah, it's good though. It's good. No, I appreciate you coming in. I was on the floor and I was keeping tabs on the, uh, on the chat there. So that's good. Glad to uh, see you popping in. Appreciate it. I'm just going to get a bit of a pec stretch here. I guess you're uh, probably heading to work shortly. It's almost that time, eh? Well, it's good to hear it went well. Fantastic. Yeah, it's always good to get those early morning workouts. I'm an early morning guy. I love I love getting in the cardio nice and early. I've done the weights early too, but uh, yeah. But I like the current split you know, that I'm doing now. You know, cardio and abs and stretching in the morning and then come back in the afternoon and knock off abs. I do like that. So Uh, where's that bar? Is it still sitting back in here somewhere? Yeah, there it is. Just getting some twists in right now. 
you feel that lower back still a little bit tight we're gonna stretch that out here in a moment I'm trying to when I do these twists I try and keep the hips from not being a part of the twist so it's just your waist Let's get this back stretching going here. Oh yeah, it felt really good there actually. Okay. Hey, Snell, if you're still there, you back on tomorrow morning, Saturday morning, bright and early, or uh, let me know.
Stars and bars. Oh, nice. Been lurking just before you finished bike and got onto the Russian twist. How are you? I, I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. Appreciate you lurking. I did. I actually, I didn't even check to see who was lurking. Sometimes I do, but I was just so in with what I was doing. Appreciate you hanging out, man. I'm actually uh, just getting ready to wrap it up. I was going to see who was on for a quick raid. How you doing? I saw you went on the other day, and I swear it was like I got three notifications that you went live, and when I finally went to check a few minutes, like 15 minutes later, you were gone. Were you having issues or something? Yeah, no, I was uh, looking for you earlier in the week, but I, th yeah, okay, all right, okay, all right. Okay, cool, yeah, I wondered about that, because I knew you've had problems in the past. I was driving home when I seen all those notifications, so got me wondering, actually. How the workouts going, by the way? I haven't chatted with you too much this week, so hopefully the workouts are still going good, though. Doing a little shoulder maintenance, stars. Okay, I think that's going to wrap it up. 636, appreciate everybody being in here. It's been awesome. Stick around. Be back this afternoon at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a big leg workout.